Hey guys, it's Matthew here again, and once again, Ronnie's my champion, but he only has $33,800. Unfortunately, he hasn't had much luck with the money cards lately. He keeps doing well, and then something goes wrong. So here we go. He's decided to take on Adam Oliver this time. Oh, hi. Good luck, Adam. Thanks. So as we start this off, As we load the cards in, first question goes to the champion, and that's you, Rodney. All right. Rodney, we asked 113 year old boys, have you played Little League Baseball? How many of these 13 year old boys, Twitter feed going off, how many of these 13 year old boys said they have played Little League Baseball? Okay, I think a lot of 13 year old boys are athletic. So I'm going to say. That's going to be a high number. I'm going to go with 61. Okay, 61 of 113-year-old boys say they have played Little League Baseball. Adam, higher or lower than 61? It looks like a good number. I'm going to go I'm gonna go a little lower. Going lower. And the actual number of these 13-year-old boys that play Little League Baseball is... 60! Adam, you are getting the nod. Ronnie, you just missed it by one. Wow. But Adam gets the nod, like I said. And Adam, your card is a nine. You can play the nine or change it. Oh, that's... Oh, let's get that nine. All right. And it's a four. Oh, that's much better. I'm going higher. Higher than a four. A ten. From here on out, you can play or freeze. Not much, not, not much cards to lose. I'm going to go lower. Oh, taking a chance. Lower than a ten. A six. That's a pretty decent card. I'll go higher. Okay, higher than a six. A queen. Oh, that's beautiful. I am going lower. Alright, for the first game already, lower than a queen. Oh no, a double queen. So you go back to the four. And Rodney, your card is a ten. Lower. Okay. Lower than a ten. Oh no, a queen. No progress made. And the question goes to Adam. It's an educated guess question. What is the fewest fewest number of days that a person has walked from L.A. to New York? Um, I think the fewest days. Um, I would say about um twenty nine. Okay, twenty nine. 29 days. Rodney, higher or lower than 29? L.A. to New York, huh? I think that's a lot higher than that. Going higher. And the actual number of days is? 54 days. It is higher. And Rodney, you still have your 10. I have to change that card. Okay. The 10 is now a king. Lower. Lower than a king, a 7. All right. Not giving Adam a chance. Third question goes to you, Rodney. Oh, goodness. Rodney, we asked 100 married women. Did you have a pillow fight with your husband? How many of these married women said yes, they had a pillow fight with a hubby? Oh, that's a good, tough question. We don't, me and what my wife don't do pillow fights too often. Thank God. Thank but God. there's some people that do. I'm going to go, this is a tough number, tough question, so I'm just going to play it uh, safe and say 50. 5-0? Yes. 50 of 100 married women say they have had a pillow fight with the husband. Adam, higher or lower than 50? 
five zero. I'm gonna say that it's. I'm gonna say that it's lower. All right, lower. The actual number of these married women who say they have had a pillow fight with a husband is forty three, just a little lower. Adam gets the nod, and you still have your four, Adam. It's a four, Adam. A, f a four. I'm going higher. Higher than a four. A ten. You can you can play it or freeze it. You know. I'm gonna take a stab and go lower. Taking a chance, lower than a ten. No. Oh no, a double ten. You go back to that four, and Rodney, you have a seven. You must play it. I'm going to go lower than a seven. Lower than a seven? Oh, no, a nine. <laughs> Fourth and final question, so I must win on this play of the cards. And the question goes to you, Adam. The control's important. Yikes. Adam, we asked 100 single women. Do you get grouchy when you don't have a man in your life? How many of these single women said yes, they do get grouchy when they don't have a man in their lives? Um, it, it kind of depends on the person, really. Um, but certain people, they do, and some people don't really, no way they don't. I'm going to say about 55. 55 of 100 single women say they get grouchy when they don't have a man in their life. Rodney, higher or lower than 55? Good number, but I think that's a little too high. I'm going to go lower. Going lower. The actual number of these married single women who get married or have that situation is 38. It is lower. You get grouchy and they don't have a man in their life. I should say single women, not married. But anyway, Rodney, you have control. You have a 7. You need 3 cards for game 1. Adam has a 4. He needs all 4 cards. You can play the seven or change it or give it to Adam. Let Adam have it. Alright. Adam, it's all yours. You must play through four oh boy, through four yeah. cards. Okay. And uh, you have a four. Oh, higher. Higher than a four? Oh no! Another four! And Ronnie has won! Adam, it's make a break for you now. Second game now. First question goes to you, Rodney. Rodney, we asked 100 wives of U.S. congressmen. Have you persuaded your husband to change his vote? How many of these wives said yes, they have persuaded the husband to change the vote? Good question. I'm sure they have done it. Oh boy, that's a good question. I'm just going to go for a low number. I'm going to go with 35. Okay. 35 of 100 wives of U.S. congressmen say they have persuaded the husband to change his vote. Adam, higher or lower than 35? Um, that's a good number. I'm going to go... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go higher. All right, higher. And the actual number of wives who say they convinced the husband is? 34! Lower, not higher. Ronnie, you are off by one. Wow. And Ronnie, your card is a king. Lower. Lower than a king. A four. Higher. Higher than a four. A ten. Alright, not giving Adam a chance. Adam, second question is yours. Adam, we asked 100 prison inmates. These are all people who are serving time at Folsom State Prison. And we asked them, have you eaten frog's legs? How many of these inmates said yes, they have eaten frog's legs? Food. Um, I would think 
going. I'm gonna go about 45. Okay, 45 of 100 Folsom prison inmates say they have eaten frog's legs. Rodney, higher or lower than 45? Well, I ate frog's legs before, and they taste like chicken. And I'm going to go lower than 45. Okay, Man. lower. The actual number of these Folsom State prison inmates say they've eaten frog's legs is 51. It is just a little higher, not lower. So, Adam, you finally get the nod. It is a 4. Alright, I'm going higher. Higher than a four. No. Oh no, a double four again. Some of these doubles. Ryan, you have your ten. Oh, I'm going lower. Lower than a ten? A five. Higher. Higher than a five for the for the championship? It is an eight, and Rodney has won again. Good try, Adam. We'll bring you back for another show. And we're going to send Rodney off to the money cards. It's time for the money cards. Rodney, you're stuck to the bottom row with $200 of betting money, where your bet rate crossed three cards. Move to the second row, give you $700 of betting money, where your bet rate crossed another three. And when you get to the big bed, you must bet at least half the money. You can win $36,800 if you play it right. And you get a choker just for making it to the money cards. And here's $200. Good luck to you, Rodney. You know about changing it, and if it's a push, for $200, Rodney, you start off with a three. Everything higher. $200. Higher than a three? It is a king. $400 and a king. Again, the whole thing. $400 lower. A queen. $800 and a queen. Gonna go to the next row no matter what. $800 lower than a queen. It is a jack. You've cleared the board on the bottom level. $700 more. You have $2,300 and a jack. I got a jack. That's a borderline card. You know what, man? I'm gonna go ahead and use my change. Okay. I'm gonna use... I'm going to change it with number three. Okay. Sometimes the jacks can be ugly. The jack is now a six. That's no better. And I have how much? $2,300. $1,000 higher. All right. Not going to run it this time. $1,000 higher than a six. It is a queen. So it was a good move on your end. You know, $3,300 and a queen. $3,000 lower. Hold him back. $3,000 lower than a queen. A deuce! $6,300 and a deuce! Okay. $6,300 higher. A joker. Okay. Trying it again. Higher. A king! Rodney, you're at the big bet. You have 12600 and a king. $12,000 lower. Hold him back. $12,000 for $24,600 lower than a king? It's a joker. I have three jokers, don't I? Yes, you have to three. Well, you know what? Now I'm going all of it lower. All right. Nothing or $25,200 lower. A jack. You did it, Rodney. Plus 200 from the game. $25,400. You're now up to $59,200. All right. Man, I had a And you find the car at the dollar sign, you win $60,000. I'm going to start with number five again. It has to be in the one thing. <laughs> okay. Okay, go on with five. No. Oh. 
two more chances. Okay, now I need to think here. I'm gonna go with three this time. Okay. Three. No. Damn. One. Okay. Is it one? No. Ah, uh, you nibbled around the edges. It was two once again. <laughs> wow. We're out of time for today, so Rodney will come back again with $59,200, and we'll see you guys next time. All right.